at judges as though they're honorable. And I'm having a difficult time with the definition of honorable. So I want someone to break this shit down for me. I want someone to explain to me what honor is. Because if the law is written and we've already wasted our tax fucking dollars writing the goddamn law and when the situation occurs and it's presented through an attorney or by an individual and the law has been broken, I want to know the purpose of all of these laws to begin with. Who the fuck are the laws protecting? This is what I see. I see that it's simplistic to blame some shit on somebody else. This could be something that they didn't even do. It's easy for a bunch of motherfuckers to group up and act like they are the ones that should be keeping all of the fucking money. But producing absolutely nothing in value when it comes to the United States of America. What I see is a whole bunch of motherfuckers protecting something that has no business being protected. They're not protecting your intellectual properties. They're not protecting your copyrights. They're not protecting your, your, your trademarks. They're not protecting your patents. So when you come up with a good idea and you try to use that idea and you try to get that idea into commerce, what is it that's protecting you? Are you expecting that the law is going to automatically side with you because some bitch ass decided to violate your rights? It, you can go you can go to this looking at it as a consumer or a business. It doesn't matter. Either way you fucking look at it and when you when you start trying to get into these particular aspects of business, your ass is going to have another thing coming. I want you to think about this from both perspectives, criminal law as well as civil law. The bitch asses that are controlling this nation at this particular point in time, I don't care who's been voted into office. I don't care how many black people, white people, Hispanic people, Asian people are in the government at this particular point in fucking time. I don't give a fuck. The motherfuckers that are right now controlling the United States government do not give a fuck about the little people. When your ass comes into a situation, it doesn't matter what that situation is, you got a whole bunch of uh, problems to look forward to. It, the government can't find that motherfucker, your ass is in trouble. I've had situations where I've been called a nigger in front of fucking somebody who is supposed to be upholding the law, who acted like they didn't fucking hear the fact that they're calling somebody a fucking nigger. This is how bad it's been. And we start talking about justice. And we start talking about how great things could be if, if people of color were this and that and the other thing. Fuck all that shit. What I want to know is who is going to uphold these laws. Why the fuck am I paying any money whatsoever in taxes toward the le legislature when their laws don't even apply once the issue has been brought to court? Why the fuck is there so much money going to paying the legislature? This is what I want to know. This is the answers that I want to bring out of these people. This is what I want to know. Is there anyone out there that can explain this bullshit to me? Because if you ask me, they don't deserve the money that they're being paid to do the deeds that they're doing. So, people, I mean, we're getting mad about stupid shit. Let's get mad about something that's for real. Tell me about the attorneys. Tell me about judgments. Tell me about problems that you've actually experienced in the United States government that have been taunting you, basically, continuously. The question is, I guess what it leads down to is, who's controlling this shit? Who is controlling this bullshit? Uh, they tell us it's the people that control it, and what fucking people actually control it is the question. You're sitting there, you're trying to pay for your house, bam, your ass is unemployed. Something is happening to you that is in violation of your rights. Now, you have to try to pay for your home, try to keep your fucking home, and if you don't have any fucking body, you'll ask the shit out of luck because they do not 
give a fuck who you are. So tell me, what the fuck do you suppose we do in these particular situations? Get violent. First thing that comes to my mind is fuck somebody up. Fuck somebody up. I mean, they just fucked you up, right? But then you take the chance of actually uh, going against police officers, going against the law, uh, the individual who will actually be violent enough to protect, quote unquote, this mass of people. So what the fuck do we do? We sit here and fucking talk about it all day, but no one's doing anything about it. Nobody's taking this fucking money out of this legislature where these people are actually supposedly making laws that are supposed to be upheld. These motherfuckers are sitting up on their high and mighty asses getting paid for doing nothing. Basically, because when you, the problem arises, the judge doesn't uphold the fucking law. So talk to me about bitch-ass attorneys.